Hey everyone, I'm Bianca Renee, and you're watching Bianca Renee today. And today is my one year anniversary of my extreme haircut. So this is my new length after one year. Now I definitely know that it's grown because at one point I could see my ears and my neck. So it was like up here status. And now it's actually grazing my shoulders. And I'm gonna show you pictures. I've been taking pictures every single month to track my progress. So now this is my day two hair, so it's probably gonna look even bigger tomorrow. But this is with, uh, what do I have in? I have Diva Curl in. When I use Diva Curl, it makes my hair extra curly and springed up. So I'm probably even experiencing a little bit more shrinkage. But in general, this is how my hair looks now. So now let me do a quick side-by-side -side comparison of my hair growth from month one all the way to now. my hair today if I pull it down it goes all the way to here now when I did my inversion method video you guys remember that it only went to my collarbone so from the time I did my inversion method video we're all supposed to grow an inch a week this is where I actually am now so it is getting pretty long and shrinkage is real okay now the question I know you all are going to ask me what did I do to make my hair grow so long so fast I swear to you guys, I don't have any hair secrets that I'm not telling you. Everything that I do to my hair, I put on my channel. So what I do, I do a deep conditioning treatment once a week. You should at least do that once a week just to really nourish your hair and clean your scalp. I also do not wash my hair every day. I wash my hair maybe twice a week. I usually can get about three, four day curls before I have to wash it again. I do use shampoo and conditioner every time I wash my hair because I use sulfate free shampoo so it's not gonna be bothersome. But if not, I could just use conditioner and I don't always have to use shampoo which would be co-washing. Hmm, what else have I been doing? Oh, I have been using my scalp massager every time I shampoo or wash my hair this little button on here and you rub your scalp. I have a whole video on the scalp massager and I have a promo code if you guys wanna buy one yourself. But this is something that I have added to my weekly wash routine. Um, I also make sure to use products that are healthy for my hair. So everything sulfate, paraben, silicone free, and that has to be helping with the health of my hair. So when your hair is healthy, it will grow. So I know I should also be probably getting little trims now and then, at least one. I have not got my hair cut at all since my last haircut. I guess I was kind of traumatized, but I didn't want to touch my hair at all for one year just to see exactly how long it would grow. So now that I've done this video, I probably will be getting a trim just to like cut off barely anything on the ends, like the very, very, very tips of it, just to get rid of any dead ends that I may have. But that's pretty much it. I'm not using any type of like special hair growing shampoo or conditioner. I've been trying so many new hair products for you guys that I've been trying a new shampoo and conditioner like every week. So I can't really keep track of what exactly is doing what anymore. But if you guys are also growing out your hair and you have some special tips and tricks that you've done that you've seen some great results, feel free to leave a comment so we all can know exactly what we could do to get longer hair faster. Before you guys go, make sure you follow me on Snapchat if you want to see what I'm up to every day and you also be the first to know what my next video is going to be about. So you can follow me on Snapchat, Instagram, and Twitter at Ms. Bianca Renee. So go ahead and follow me right now. 
And if you like this video, there's plenty more where that came from. I post new videos every Sunday, so I hope to see you guys next week. Thanks for watching Bianca Renee today.